Well, last year I had weedy soybeans. Oh. But then a neighbor said, why don't you use chemical? Chemical? Now, how would you find out about a thing like that? Well, I called the chemical companies. Who'd you call? DuPont, Belsico, Chevron, Stauffer, Mobile, Mobe, Seba, Geige, Elenco, Monsanto, BASF, Dow Shell, 3M, FMC, PBG, Union, Carbide, American Cyanamid. They listened to me when I called and laughed and said, we're glad you did. Wow, that's a lot of places to call. What'd they tell you? Use chemical. What kind did you use? Lasso, Bassagran, Loris, Van Tol, Van Suit, Tensor, Flan, Trep, Flan, Amaban, Modown, Banville, Vaseline, 2,4-D, Lorax, Sencor, Atrix, Blitex, Pursuit, Accent, Pinnacle, Classic, Round of Bat, Dizine, enough to make it turn green. I sprayed everywhere, man. I sprayed everywhere, then sprayed it from the air. I boyed here and there, incorporated it for fair. Yeah, I sprayed everywhere. Now, I took that chemical and sprayed it on my weeds. Oh, yeah? What kind of weeds did you have? Ragweed, smartweed, buttonweed, pigweed, bindweed, milkweed, cockleburn, mustard, quackgrass, crabgrass, nutgrass, watergrass, goosegrass, nightshade, foxtail, artichoke, lamb's coat, or thistle, morning glory, mallow, first lane, dog's bane, they didn't grow back again, because I sprayed everywhere, man, I sprayed everywhere, then, sprayed it from the air, I boyed here and there, and incorporated it for fair, yeah, I sprayed everywhere. Now that chemical killed all my weeds. Killed all your weeds, yeah! That chemical killed every darn soybean I had. Killed all your beans? Ooh. I called the chemical companies back. Well, I should say, what'd they tell you? You didn't read the label. I didn't know what to do. Well, what would you do in a case like that? I called the county agent. What a good idea. When you don't know what to do, call your county extension agent. He wasn't in. Oh, no. Then I remembered, two weeks before, I'd bought hail insurance on those beans. But, Dan, you didn't have hail on those beans. Well, you know, that's what the adjuster said when he'd come out and looked at them. He'd never seen hail burn a bean down from the top before. <laughs> oh, no, what did you do then? We had to change that hail adjuster's attitude, that's what we did. Well, how would you adjust a hail adjuster's attitude? Take him to a bar. We walked into the bar, me and the hail adjuster, and I said, Hey, bartender, give me a five-gallon bucket. Wow, what would you put in that? Jim Beam, Old Crow, Jose Cuero, Southern Comfort, Amaretto, Phillips, Vodka, Rum, Kalua, Four Star, Granddad's quite a brew, huh? Gin, wine, and beer, malt liquor, and cream on top to make it thicker. Oh, what did you do with that? Gave it to the hail adjuster. You gave that to the hail adjuster? He drank every drop. He drank it? And then it was like a miracle. He gave us 100% loss on all our soybeans. Yay! What a wonderful ending to your story. Not quite. What I saw next, I never want to see again the rest of my life. Why? What happened? Well, he got sick, and he sprayed everywhere, man. He sprayed everywhere, then flew up in the air, dropped down here and there. We got out of there, and he sprayed everywhere.